Hey everyone, Steven at uh, uh, Chorus Daily here. So one of you guys uh, make a joke that it's Chorus biannually now. So thank you for that joke. I'm gonna try to upload a little bit more often from now on. But uh, here it is a uh, second day of my tank update. So um, one thing I wanted to quickly show is what I add to my tank as far as fish anyways. So one thing that I really um, added a lot is the little damsels. Uh, or green chromis, I should say. Uh, I initially added 30, and naturally, you know, not all of them are gonna survive. Some of them came in a little emaciated and um, just not looking well, but most of them are eating well. So I counted the other day, there's still 25 of them, and I'm actually getting a 10 more. So hopefully, eventually, I have like somewhere between 30 to 35. I think it really adds a little bit of a layering because I have some of this medium-sized fish in here um, and um, they the the, um, the chromis is really filling the space for them. And also I got uh, three of the uh, <laughs> anthias. I don't know, my, I'm having a brain fart. But uh, you know that how they are like a different kind of uh, orange-ish um, purple than the actual purple queen antheas. There's a couple of them kind of hiding in this cubby hole right now. And oh, there's one out. But uh, so I'm getting a few more of those too, just so that they can group together. But it's all, it's really funny how antheas, even different antheas and the uh, chromises will all swim together. And they've all been eating very well. See, some of them are actually yawning a little bit and they will follow me, darting like back and forth following me. Um, another thing I've added back here, well, not really an addition to the system, but to the tank, is this uh, blue head uh, rass here. I'm so sorry, my morning brain. You know this whole um, time shift with the daylight saving is just not working out for me. <laughs> it's, it still feel like too early for me. But anyway, so this guy was sleeping, or I should say living in the sump for the longest time. And I, um, when I was cleaning out the sump, as you can see in my last episode, that I moved it in here, along with my Cuban hawkfish, which I'm gonna share with you. I, this was totally unexpected because this guy and the Cuban hawkfish live together in the sump peacefully, doing just fine. And when I moved both of them into this big tank, they started um, attacking on each other for. No reason at all. I, I I totally don't understand. And if any of you know why would two fish live in a tighter space, get on violent, more violent to each other when I move them to a larger space, that to me is a mystery. But anyways, so um, turns out the bluehead go, uh, wrasse is actually more dominant or aggressive than the Cuban hawkfish. So the Cuban hawkfish unfortunately did not make it by the time i was able to get him out he was too injured and he only survived in the basket uh, for a little bit longer um and well, and then one last fish i added in here which i'm still not sure if it's a mistake or not it could be a mistake um is a just a regular um fox fox face lobo um i already have a magnificent fox face the fox face lobo i added is about the same size I was hoping that they wouldn't fight, but they started fighting. Um, that said, I also have tanks fighting with each other when I add them, and they're doing totally fine with each other right now. So hopefully, there'll just be a phase. They'll get over it um, and move on, since it's a large enough system. And uh, they, 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 they do have enough spaces to kind of hide from each other and shield from each other. And there's definitely more than plenty of food in here. So that's kind of the update today and uh, hopefully things will continue to improve among all these new fish. I should have more of the chromises and the uh, antheas coming in tomorrow. The spar anthea, that's what their main names are. Thank you. And um, so hopefully um, they'll come in tomorrow and I'll make another update. So thank you guys. I will see you later.